All right, welcome to the Saturday exclusive. Yes, we're back on Saturdays, bitches. Hey, Lee, what's up? Hi, how are you doing? I'm doing all right. You're going to say the sky is up again or your ceiling's no, up? No, 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 no. I got some notes here. I don't think I I had these notes last week, but I was so fucking drunk like I am now. Oh, boy, I hope that it's not going to be a three-hour I don't think I... Like you're... Oh, Never mind. Go those on. three hour episodes go by fast because we're having fun, dude. Come on. Oh, 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 I don't mean oh, oh. it to be three hours. I kind of try to keep it at under two. But Believe shit. it or not, when, when I was on the episode, I actually am surprised that I stayed on the whole th- whole thing. So for, for me... Mark- Never, never mind. Let's let's let's. He's talking about on. Mark and Jerry with. Uh, uh, you, you don't need to. Yes, you, you 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 don't need. Well, come to. on, we got a um, we got a fucking pimp, Charles. Come on, Charles needs a pimp. Well, I'll tell you this, without necessarily naming a specific episode, I will say there was one episode that was interesting. That, I, went on. Because I thought it would be interesting, and you did a lot of um, BSing about other things, which for me would have been fine for five minutes, but it went on for about twenty. And then, and then when when you finally did what you were talking about, it was fine until I found that people didn't said like what stuff you liked. that I <laughs> disagreed with. And 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 then by that time, I still tried to listen, and and I listened to an hour, and it was a two and a half hour episode. But at least instead of fifteen minutes, I listened to an hour, so that was good. Uh, the thing is, it's called BS. We bullshit. We bullshit before we get to the topic at can't at hand. No, we I do, know what you mean. We do music news. But we just don't say the music news. We say what we think about the news. You know, no, we give our opinion. I, I know, and 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 um, if it was anything that I had not heard before, then that would have been fine. But I mean, well, you, I, you 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 continue to have the same opinion. A lot of these podcasts, else. after I do that, that news, they seem to have the same news a week later. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm on top of all this shit, but um, I. Okay, okay, but 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 what I want to say is that to me, I I rarely listen to podcasts much anymore. There's only a couple that I might listen to, depending upon the subject. But I mean that includes yours or 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 the ones that we do. You know, I I don't usually listen. I went back and listened because you brought up, I brought up that I want to do the the new Red Chili Peppers album, the Dream Canteen album, and you said, yeah, that'd be cool because you know whatever. But yeah, I don't yeah, want to. Yeah, I don't yeah, want to. Yeah, I don't want to say that, it on that, here. That was, be, that was because of a text. But that's we did, not because of an episode. No, but we did an episode of uh, Red Hot Chili but Peppers what, with you. All I want so to I say said, is you that, you could you could show this well, 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 well. yeah 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 of course and 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 that's cool and and so i'm glad that you told me about that i'm i'm not telling you what we really talked about just talking about there's an episode for you to share <laughs> that's yeah, it yeah because sure. i'm not a dick but uh i want to ask you, you something lee because you're kind of stuck in a box with your musical when we, we, we you say that I agree with you, even though I don't like you saying that, but but I have to say I'm 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 kind of like my uncle's dog who got crawling into his pant legs and then he started barking because he couldn't get out. I'm oh. sort of like that. I'm I'm kind of like a dog who's stuck in my uncle's pant leg. Yeah, but I think I I didn't ask you this last week because I was really fucking drunk, like I am now. Okay, well then, let's hope that you get more drunk so you don't have so now, Lee, anyway. You can't pick an album from the fifties or sixties, or an obscure album. Ricky have, Nelson. No, you have to pick an album that people know. What would it be? 
that you would like that you like to listen to. But people don't listen to Ricky Nelson usually. I said you can't pick 50s, 60s, or 70s. I remember that you asked me that before. Fuck you, you asshole. You didn't answer it. <laughs> so you got God 80s, 90s, it. 2000s, or now. What albums should everybody listen to? What decade should I start with? You could do the 80s. What album in the 80s? And we could go to the 90s and so on, you know. Black and Blue's first album. That's not an album everybody knows. Well, the <laughs> fuck. Pick an album that's popular that you liked. I can't pick both. It can either be an album that's popular or an album that I like. Oh, wait. Go Go's Head Over Heels. Does that count? That wasn't an album that was on Beauty and the Beast or Beauty and the Beat, right? No, that was an album. Head Over. No, that wasn't I'm an album. That, that was on show. Talk Show. Talk, talk Show. show. <laughs> okay, Talk so Show. Does that count? Yes, that counts. That was a that was an album. So, okay, people... yeah, I, I I can I can do that. So what? Give me an album from the nineties that you liked that was popular. Oh, didn't we already do live? Live or live? Yeah, we did live. You like that album? Throwing Coffee? that was from the nineties. Yes, we already did it, and I liked it a lot. So how about the two thousands? That's a hard one. Oh, oh, I, I, I don't know. Um, how about an album from today that everybody knows? Not that everybody knows. I don't know that. I know you don't. That's we already it. did Skid Row. Oh yeah, you like that album, so that's cool. And then I'm gonna ask you. So, so please don't ask me more shit like that, please. Well, because... well you can ask, but I. But if I can't give you an answer, I would like you to at least understand. I did. I that, moved on. That I tried. Thank I did. you. I moved on. You said Skid Row. And I said, that's cool. And Thank then, you. But and in but, fact, we should do an album by Skid Row called That's Cool. They don't have an album called that. Or is that the well, original? Well, we should Skid Row? do it. We did the no, original no. Skid Row with Gary Moore, right? I'm being fucking with you. I know you're being fucking with me. Yeah, that's funny how you talk spoke broken English there. That was cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I, I do I do <laughs> spoken word fucking with you. Fucking blocking. And then uh what is the worst band of all recorded history besides fun? <laughs> oh <laughs> I know you hate fun. Hate I don't fun. have um, the worst recorded band. Oh, I don't have any other, but would you settle for a group that's maybe, by the way, when I'm pausing when I'm talking it's only because of the phlegm or the spit in my throat that I have to swallow it's not because I'm pausing in my mind it's You're only getting because... a little flaclent yeah thank you okay so um but but I I would say um a band that back in the how about this how about a band that back when i was about six i heard and i thought oh i don't like them so so they were the equivalent of fun even if i like them better than fun now comparatively they were still Back in the early 70s, the worst band that I heard. Does that count? Yeah, what was the band? Bread. Oh, God, they see you suck. I agree with you on that one, man. Well, that was like adult, contemporary, contemporary. You know, I'd rather listen to James Taylor than Bread. 
Would you believe that I agree with you? That's awesome. I like it when you agree with me because, but you, you know always what? say we agree. <laughs> well, we don't. You know, there's an album by Is James it? Taylor called Mud Slid, Mud Slide Jim and the New Confession or the New Whatever. It's it's like Mud Slide Jim and the Something Something. And it's about 20 songs, but about 10 of them are about a half minute long. Will you be into doing that album? I would do it because James Taylor is it's, rock. It's not, it's not a bad album. No, I'll be the judge of that. But then I get to... Uh... What is I'll wrong? Be the judge of it I want I like you to it. give I give my opinion. I don't, I don't think I've asked you. I've asked you why you don't like today's music. But what is wrong with today's music? It's not a matter of that. It's more a matter of the people who do today's music. Not always, but sometimes they they like to act like the other music didn't exist. And then when new people listen to it, they agree. It's like, let's say, for instance, there's an old pizza parlor that's close to where you live called Giuseppe's Pizza. <laughs> and Giuseppe... um did the pizza when you were a young kid and you remembered him. And then his son does the pizza. And it's not as good as the father did, but it's still okay. And then his son continues the tradition and does pizza that's as good as the other pizzas, but... It's not as good as either his dad or his granddad. But you still go there because it's still Giuseppe's. Ingrained in my memory and, that that and, pizza and, and, was and so, so good. And, and, so, and so you talk about Giuseppe's pizza to people who then go to these new places who do it just like the grandson does it, but not at all like the original. And they say, you know what? You're correct. Giuseppe's was the best, but you remember the old days. It's, it's kind of like that. It's like, I'm not saying that the new bands are bad, but they don't go for anything that sounds like what I really liked back in the day. Abby, did you listen to the last um, Rock Olympia now, now, podcast? Now, 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 before you ask me, I will say there are bands that you like that I don't like at all. What are so, those bands? But, but, tell, but me, before, tell me what those bands are. No, before... Well, maybe, but 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 I I want. So I know what to pick when you pick a like a United States of America on me. (laughs) I would say Ario Speedwagon, but I do like some of them. So we 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 still need to do Good Trouble and High Infidelity. And I would say Queen, but I do still like some of them though. So fuck you. So we. So I guess I guess there's there's no band that you like. That I don't totally dislike, so fuck you. But what I want to say is You don't but, even you like extreme too. I like a couple of their albums. But yeah. what I'm I guess what I'm trying to say is I, I, I don't what was the original question? Because I forget. I said what what's wrong with today's music? there's nothing actually wrong with it it's just that a lot like for instance California Breed or Winery Dogs or other groups they have 
people who have done really great music, but they sound like they are trying purposefully to do music for a new audience. And I don't feel it. Dude, I think you really need to go back and listen to the first two Winery Dogs albums. I have playlists of the songs from the Winery Dogs. If you want to do a Winery Dogs album, I will do it as long as you don't make me say I'm not going to do another group. If, if, if you can stop with dibs for another group, I, I know... I only did dibs. To, oh, I only, I, I, all I want to say is... <laughs> I only you did don't dibs do, on one group. All I'm trying to say okay. is if you don't do more groups, I will do the winery dogs. Okay. That's... But if but, you want to talk about Moody Blues or James Gang, you can. But but I that was I you, said you could do it on your show too. So all enjoy. I'm trying to as say, long as you don't cut all me off. I'm trying to say is that you sometimes say things on purpose because you want to have hashtag love from people. And and the thing is. You can I don't do want that to on the Mark and people. Jerry. <clears throat> you can do all that on the Mark and Jerry thing, but on mine, I don't want to have that much of a boring thing. We ain't boring, dude. Yeah, you are, but but we what are, I'm you to are. Say is, no, no, I'm 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 talking about your other show, but but what I'm trying to say is, you 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 do stuff on purpose to get me to say stuff, but. Even though it's good for a minute or, or for a clue, hey, dude, it's I, actually boring. You you, but, you should but, not do that. I'm not because gonna, I find it boring. I'm not. I'm gonna, not saying it's I, it's morality can I, bad. Can I'm I just say trying something? To say, no, you can. After I want to say one more th okay thing. I think that it's you have. A really good podcasting style, but your jokes are stale. Anyway, go on. Like, like dude, fuck off. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, I, I like say, that. Actually. What I'm going to say, I don't make you do, I never made you do a year in episode on Freeform that we do the best albums of what year we're in. You know, I'm going to say that for Mark and Jerry with Charles. We're going to do the best albums of. 2022 i don't do that with those you. are actually those are actually probably better than than the stuff that i'm talking about well do you want to do a best of 2022 i, I I'm, I'm not saying too. that i would but but what i'm trying to say is that it's i don't want to talk about the episode not because i don't want to talk about the episode but because i don't want to give a bad name to an episode that other people might want to hear so that's the point is like i i don't want i don't want to say i i don't want to say don't listen to an episode because the point is you're doing the episodes because you want listeners but what i want to say is i want to be can i certain, tell you why i do episodes can i tell certain you why episodes that i have heard on the BS sessions, I purposefully listened because I thought they would be good. And to your credit, there was one episode that you did that as I was able to hear about one hour of it as opposed to only 20 minutes. But the the I have to tell you this, the the subject matter was absolutely brilliant. But all of you 
including friends of mine who are on the episode, ruined it <laughs> with your opinion. So, so, so I, I that's my fault. That's mm -hmm. not your fault. I'm Is it sorry. Night Ranger? What no, but but no, no. <laughs> oh, yeah. But 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 those episodes I might check out just because I don't like them that much. And I'm thinking <laughs> I might think that's fun. Dude, did you do an episode on what Night Ranger or what? We, we did it like a we made an album of Night Ranger. I think I will listen to those more than the <laughs> ones that I'm talking about. We did we, we, you know the Jeff uh, Leppard. No, we, never mind. We did the Fleppard. No, 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 never mind. But I basically picked ten arm Def Leppard over nine arm Def Leppard. So. Charles. Okay, you, 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 you're correct. Um, what, well, what I want to say. Do you want me to be really honest with you? Because I, I oh, don't. I, Lee, I want you to be honest. Do with you me mind at all if times. I go in the fuzzy? room because the thing is just go I'll, in the fuzzy room i don't care i'll do that and 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 i'm totally fine with it it's the charm of this video we get hazy. because we get because hazy shade of lee and, and 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 i will give you my drunken opinion because the problem wasn't actually the there he goes drink it drink it up drink it up yeah buddy I'm out of whiskey, but your favorite man still sucks. Oh, I'll, I'll t <laughs> all right, all right. I'll tell you this. Um, hey, Chris and Zach, you rule. Okay, go ahead. That's that's cool. I um, so does I Rob had absolutely, Sierra. I had absolutely nothing against the idea of the episode. In fact, I was eager to listen to it. And I found first that the round robin of each song that each person picks, for me personally, I find that to be not interesting. I would rather see each person do the list of their songs in order. But that's me. That doesn't mean other people would not like it. But when I saw, for instance, that Ralph picked Overture, and then I saw that both Charles and you picked Lady Strange, which was a good song, by the way. But up there, as far as your favorites i i thought to myself okay how much longer can i listen to this episode i will say jerry has a good rapport he can he can do good um andy garcia is an intelligent guy i'm not going to talk about his picks all i'm going to say is that He's intelligent as a person. But I found that of the episodes so far, that was the one I was able to listen to the most. I might still finish eventually because that episode at least was interesting. And I, I, I've got to say, you are a hospitable and good vibe host. It's just that I'm going to be kind of humorous when I say this. You need someone to tell you what to say. You, you. you need you you need me to give you my opinions over yours in order to say, <laughs> okay, my in other words, Lee's opinion is in other words. You you know what I mean, but but I mean, like I said, I'm being joking. The 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 point is, you're actually good. It's just that, for me, listening wise, I find that the best moment 
in any particular podcast is when they get right to the point. Because um, even though the Giles Martin thing with the revolver and all that is interesting, it's interesting to me for a minute, not 10 minutes or 20 minutes. You but I, it's I, not it's not my episode. It's not something that I'm involved in, so I shouldn't have to say it. And I feel bad saying it because who am I? I'm just a guy listening to it. But as a guy listening to it, I asked you if I could say, so I did say. But I mean, I don't want you to change for me, but I but I want I would not mind if you think about what I say and then decide on your own self. Lee, how Lee, you feel. Yeah, I'm saying that's yeah, all I want to say. I'm always okay. thinking, would Lee like this? If Lee would like this, I d I I don't like it. I'm joking. Because <laughs> uh, you saying. know what? I myself. You know, we we agree like ninety five percent of the time. It used to be ninety nine percent of the time, but you know what? It went down. Sometimes, um, when I do an episode, I'm thinking to myself, believe it or not, I'm thinking, will Mark have his feelings hurt, or or when Charles is on, will he have his feelings? The only thing I can hurt not, when I'm, Charles I'm, is on, I'm not is that you do albums that I I would. Love to do with Edwin Conestrachi or Eddie Conestrachi, emotional rex rescue um, of the Rolling Stones, and I, and or the I Moody ask, Blues. Can, but you did Andy you, Gibb. I was fine with you guys doing Andy Gibb. Can I can I tell Gibb. you something? Go ahead. Um, I think Edwin is a wonderful guy. I think that he's as long winded as you. Um, I, I let I, you talk I, more um, than I do. I mean, I mean, um, come on, Lee. I I told him on an episode when I'm on with Eric. I said I thought this is going to go on to the boring level, and um, um, but I don't want what 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 I want to say is that yeah. In other words, I want to say some. Um, yeah, this I was some that, this episode. You're that, Mr. Longwinded here. All right, it, go ahead. I, I want to say Bob Hayes said something that he might not have meant to be public, but you but can't I'm say his name on these shows, he gets pissed at me, right. even though but, he's still my friend. I can say it because he does contact me. So, well, let's let's just say Mr. So and so. Um, Thought that I'm boring because I give way too long sentences. The truth is, I do. I give way too long sentences. I don't disagree with them. I think that I'm actually, I'm disappointed at myself. The one thing that I will say is that, yeah. So yeah, um, you've talked way more than I have in this episode. I, I, I so want to I apologize to. I want to apologize to you. Uh, in fact, I want to keep quiet and I want you to talk for a while. I don't want to talk because you know what? You're the entertaining guy. Uh, you know what? <laughs> the, 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 the point is that Mr. Can I people, say Mr. People, I, I'm going to tell you something, Lee. People Mr. never give People never give me compliments on our episodes they always talk about what lee said i never get you compliments believe that on my not dad that good as a podcaster I'm, you're better than i, I am in our I'm, I'm 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 good at at giving maybe opinions but i'm not good as far as vocal dude what i get, you're a oh, much you're a much better vocal guy than me but, but, but what i get is what you say everybody says i love it when lee said this i love it when lee said that i love it when lee said that you know what that's cool because we're you're talking watching about both two of us. people no the thing is the compliments i get on our episodes or 
YouTube episodes. I never whatever. see them. I see it's because they tell me, not you. They tell me I love it when Lee says, "You know what? I like this, then but why I don't, don't like they it." Tell me. I don't know why they don't tell you. They tell me all of the. They never. I have never once got a compliment of any jokes how, I have said. It's how many? You. How many? You are the star of this podcast. Approximately, approximately, in a particular episode, how many people have said stuff about me to you? They said, "How dude, many? A lot, dude. A lot. Uh, 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 give, I, give I, me, I never give once." Me, I've give never me, give, once... give me give listen, me what listen, what, what listen, you Linda. Is I've never got I've maybe, never got maybe a, a number a number million trillion I'm just saying uh, I've never maybe maybe I... 10 or 15 well yeah because we get 40 downloads an episode but the thing so, is so 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 listen listen Linda approximately listen, with with about the 40 how many of the 40 is what I'm saying it's all about you. Maybe, it's maybe. All, how many? It's how all, many? It's how all, many? Listen, how listen. many? That's the give, question. But I can't. I'm, give, not, I, I'm, I'm not saying exactly, but in your maybe in, forty in, in your, of the I, maybe forty of the fifty downloads. Tell me, okay, how you were. that's that's all I'm trying to say. Okay. That's pretty good. The thing is, Lee. I never get a compliment on anything I say. I think I'm funny, but it's always about what you say. Um, I never get compliments about my opinion. You know what I think? I I I kind of want to give you what I think might be hurtful for me, but I think that some people who are trolls want to listen to me because they know that I don't have a really good podcast voice. Oh, so they want to listen to me dude. because dude, seriously, they, you, they, they you, want, you are they want to listen to the clown boy. You are, and... the clown. you aren't the clown boy. You have very serious, honest, Fucking opinions, like I. Do. I'm not talking but the about thing the is, opinions. You are funnier I'm than I am. About, I go. Um, I have um, to sniff um, whiskey um, to um, get um, get um, laughs. Um. Okay. I I go um 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 a lot. Um. But I have to sniff whiskey or a booze to get laughs. You I thank just, you. You just be I yourself. Thank you for what, what I thank you for what you said because um um you know. What I want to say is okay. I will. I will get up. I okay. will erase what I just said. What I want to say is no. You won't because I'm the one who puts it up. No, 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 no. I'm. I'm. I'm just saying theoretically. I need some as far as my opinion, Lock him out. I. I want. I. I, I want to. I got some. Movie. Not give myself credit for something. In other words, I want to say I said something, but I'm going to correct it. All right. Um, what I want to say is that for, for, do you mind if I tell you something about when I first heard you on a podcast and what I thought? Do you I mind if I, I was on a shitty podcast, but go ahead. When I first heard you on a podcast, I'm not going to give what the podcast is i'm just going to say when i heard you i thought this guy actually has a good personality i like his vibe i like his um stuff i think he's cool and then when i heard your opinion of the album i thought oh <laughs> but but we agree lee come on but but what I want to say is, as far as your ability to be a podcast host, I thought, and I still think, you have a natural ability. You have 
Would you believe that I actually think that you're better than me? That that's impossible, dude. There's no re dude. I'm sorry. The compliments I get are all about you, Lee. I'm, I'm crying, but I'm crying because don't cry, man. Big hug, brother. I you're you. better than me. I am not better than you. We are great together. You are oh, great. I'm trying... Okay. Oh, you're great, dude. I'm not crying because oh, I'm crying be I'm sorry. Dude, I'm crying be because sad. I'm drunk. I'm drunk. What too, I'm bitch. trying to What I'm trying to say is you have if it came to okay. I'm not I'm not talking about personal opinions about albums. I'm just, you know, talking about your ability to project as a host. I would say I never worked a lot on it. Um, I have to say there are some people who have told me that they think that I'm totally professional. You and are. I, and, and you're I, you're I very to professional. Wow. You're so, here, man. It rules. I could not <laughs> have another co-host on this podcast. And if fact, I did, I want, it would, it would I suck. want to apologize to you for my... Um... Crying, you can put this on the show. It's on the show, is, man, because it's it's genuine. Is, we are genuine. We this are wrong. Is a, <laughs> rule, in dude. fact, in fact, I but this is what I <laughs> if if you don't mind, I, I'm I'm still on the show. I I just want to give a really quick. Um, um, well, while you're doing your really quick drink, I'm just gonna say, I am. I, oh, thankful. thank you, thank you. I, I, I am, I, thank, I, I am thankful for you. I am thankful for everybody I've made on Facebook, made friends on Facebook, all the podcasts, Ralph Vieira, you, Ian Wiley, Eric Ernstby Jord, Eddie Conestrachi, Jerry Sue, you know what? Charles Trainer. I am thankful for all of you because without Facebook. I wouldn't have met any you know of you. What? And without Facebook, I wouldn't have met my wife that I love so very dearly. That's, you know what, that's the thing that is the most important thing is that you have a wife, a partner who you and her are like that together. That to me is beautiful. That's not why I'm crying. I'm crying. Well, it took me fucking two people. She's my well, third wife. It took what? me two bad wives to get to the greatest one I've ever had. Diane Baker Taylor, you rule. Sometimes things happen like that. The only reason why I'm crying is because it's overload from when I cried before. So it's like, da, 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 da. but what I want to say is, I'm actually um, thinking the point is, I do have certain opinions about music, and I've had them since I was four or five. And I remember the song that I wrote when I was about six and maybe five. But I'm I'm patting my chest right now because I, I got a, a little slightly bit just for the moment a burn in my my chest. So if if, if I if I didn't talk a lot, it's only because of the physical burn, but now 
it's gone. But but what I want to say is, um, each person has their own, like, what did I listen to when I grow up? The only reason why I get upset or get testy when people don't get what I listen to is because I don't want to be the odd man out. I don't want to be someone who likes to have other people who are willing to listen to what I do. And then when I pick albums that are purposefully to screw with other people, it's only in this way, that's when I'm an a-hole. That's because if I hear an album that somebody likes that I don't like, that's when I get testy. So that's when I get to be an a-hole and I go, you know what? I want to give an album to them because they gave me that album. And so I want to test them. So but that's you, but kind you did of like these days by Bon Jovi with that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Sorry. But, I but, 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 no, no. In truth, do you want to know the, the, the truth behind that? Sure. I asked the people in a group. I'm not going to give the name of the group. I'm only going to say it was a group. And I asked them, what album would you suggest that I do in order to get back at you? <laughs> and they mentioned these days. And then I honestly went back to them and I got angry with them and I said screw you all because you gave me an album that I liked and why the hell did you do that when I thought you were on my side and then I got answers like well since we didn't care one way or the other we just picked whatever album and we didn't even think about it so now then I know that but in truth even though I have, I'm probably totally too drunk, I but I have to say, dude. and I got to go eat Thanksgiving dinner I, for the third time. Hey man, I, I would love to eat the dinner for you, but in truth, when it comes to Bon Jovi over some of the other groups, I can't say that I don't like some of the Bon Jovi stuff. That I yeah, we still need to do Bounce. Yeah, it's like um, that's one of my favorite. Bon would Jovi you albums. believe? Would, would would you believe that there are other groups that like when it comes to fun? If it was the difference between doing one fun album or on, or only six other Bon Jovi, I would pick six other Bon Jovi. Um, I, 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 please, I, fun, I don't want you to remember No, that. I, 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 I but, spread yeah, out the Bon Jovi for they, you, you know. They, oh, oh, yeah, 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 you spread out the pigeon shit for me, but, but, um, <laughs> but, but no, I mean, the, the 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 truth is the first couple of Bon Jovi albums, the first one and the second one and whatnot. Back in the day, I heard them and um, the Runaway video I liked because of the girl in the video. And 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 She's I know hot. what you're gonna say, but 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 I mean, uh, other Your than that, tucked in. I I know I know, but but what I'm trying to say, no, it's okay. But what I'm saying is, other than that. I tried to listen to it and I couldn't like it. That That's all like I want to say. Roy Bretan on keyboards. Oh, she's a little runaway. Oh, that's a great song. Um, there's a. Do you know who Max Weinberg is? 
Yeah, he's a drummer of the E Street Band. He was in a group back in the 70s, and we could do one of their albums sometime. That's a good album. We still need to do a Springsteen album. Seriously. You know what? I love Bruce. I don't care what his political affiliations are with. I he makes good like... music. Is it okay if I mention albums? Go ahead. Okay. Um, I do not like Born to Run, but I like Born in the USA. Because I love that, that album. Tunnel of Love, great album too. It's Tunnel cool. of Love, I'll listen to, but, but what I'm going to say is The River, my mom liked that album. I did not. Darkness but on if, the Edge of Town? But the wild darkness innocent on e the sheet shuffle. Oh, on. darkness and 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 the the um East Street Town. Yeah. Shuffle. So I would what, like to do his live album. Dude. Do? I want to do I want to do an epic Bruce Springsteen. Like Springsy like like a like 75 a song I want to do the album. 70 I want to do the 75 to 85 live album. Is that like 70 or 85 songs on it? No, it, it's a big album set. But the thing is, they're the live versions of the songs. Born to Run is oh, way better word. live than on the album. I don't agree with you. In fact, I, I don't want to do um a, 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 a four album set. Why don't we do Live in New York City? That's a live album. That's not four albums. Is that two albums or one album? I think it's a double CD. I'll get back to you, but but I I don't like his live. Well, I like the early live stuff, but I'll get back to you on it. But that's I'm not seventy-five to, to eighty-five. No. That is lot early live stuff. It has Adam Ray's the Cane. Uh, but I can, uh, you know, all that. I shit. will listen the to river, it, but, but 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 my the stories that he tells, like, I'm gonna tell one story that he tells. He tells about that his dad always said, Let the military get you, let the military get you, they'll make a, they'll make a man out of you, right? And he comes in on this song, I can't remember the name of the song, but he um... says. I, I got my draft card, draft notice. I he... left my house for the week. Let me finish, Lee. All right, sorry. Left my house for the weekend. I went and took my draft. He went and took his physical. He failed because he had flat feet. So he comes to it, comes into the kitchen after being gone for the whole weekend. And his dad goes, where were you, son? Because I was taking my draft physical. So what happened? I failed. And his dad goes, that's good, son. And that made me cry. That's cool. but Because his dad always said, say. wait till the military gets you. They'll make a man out of you. He came in when Bruce got into a motorcycle accident, shaved all his hair off because he thought it was a hippie. But Bruce um, tells the best stories of any rock artist out there. He hitchhiked with people and asked them their stories and they told them their stories and then he wrote them down. So about 90% of the stories that you say are his are actually stories that other people told him. But the that story about him going to mean, his draft physical, that I think, doesn't was necessarily his. mean that they're bad stories. But I think, in the fact, story, they're good stories. The story he told about his dad, I think, they're is true. About him, the story about his dad, I think, is true about him going to the draft. He's about that age. Well, then I also he told about his dad coming in and, and shaving all his head off. Cool hair off. Um, thumbs up to Charlie Sheen who said, you know what? If I was asked to go in the draft, I would go to Canada. You know what I mean? Yeah. I respect that. You know, the Vietnam War sucked, 
nobody should have went to the fucking Vietnam War. Should have let them hash it out. Nobody's no no war is good. No war is good. Especially especially the Vietnam War. You know what? I'm going to say that I agree with you because I don't want to say anything else. But so he's like I agree. Born on the Fourth of July with Tom Cruise, man. Great movie. How the, those people got spit on when they were forced. You know to go what? To the fucking Vietnam the, War. The guy Ron Kovic who wrote that got his, you know, amputee because of the stuff that he went to. He he was the guy who Tom Cruise portrayed, but he did write. The, you know the the movie. Um, the thing is, a lot of people say stuff about Tom Cruise. I'm not going to get into that. But what I'm going to say is Rain Man. Two. I think that Tom Cruise was great in Rain Man. A great I actor. Think, he's a I great think actor. He I should have won. That, I think that he's a fantastic. Um, he's one of the best actors of all time. I and, would love and every to time do, he's nominated, Tom Hanks wins. So, I would love to. You know what? This is something that I don't usually talk about. I don't talk about my dreams, but I will say there's one dream I had where. I met Tom Hanks in the dream and I said, would you sign something for me? And I forget what it was that I wanted to sign. It might have been like a coupon for a package of cigarettes, even though I didn't smoke them. But I, but whatever the hell it was, I wanted him to sign it. But I couldn't find the pen. And so I said to anybody... Does anybody have a fucking pen? Because I want Tom Tom Hanks to sign this. And 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 Tom Hanks says, Well, I, I gotta go on the plane because the plane's moving really quick. And went, well, give me a moment. And, and, and it's like finally I think I found like a piece of charcoal or something that was like it wasn't even gonna work. And 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 it's like um a, but but then I woke up. The other thing that I I had a a, a dream just recently. I'll I'll mention it. Um, my birth mom. I, I I um, she she wore sloppy clothes. So so but 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 the person in my dream seemed to be dressed well, and I thought it was Madonna, and I thought in the dream. I would fuck that, Madonna now. That 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 my um Just birth mom was Madonna, wife, but 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 anyway, what, what I want to say is I I don't know what it was, but the the person whoever it was who looked like my birth mom who looked like someone, I gave them some sort of um like score music for um something and and so as a as a gift they gave me the the music to my little pony <laughs> and so i'm like i'm i'm looking and, and and it looks like it's a pillow or it's like some sort of a weird thing for my little pony and i'm like so I actually looked under the thing for My Little Pony, but it's like I was trying to find like classical music for My Little Pony, and I can't. All I know is that it it just seemed weird. Like, why does this hot-looking lady who looked like she could have been my birth mom give me this like big puffed up notebook of my little pony which was supposed to be like you either play it 
on piano or you crank it on the stereo and play. It's like, you know what dreams are like? Hi, I, I saw my friend, but my friend said he's not here. And he pointed to himself and he was across the street. So I said, I'm not going to see you. I'm going to see you across the street. So I go across the street and then I find out that neither of you are real. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's like that song by Real Speedwagon in my dreams. And we climb, we climb, and at the top we fly. What the album world is that? Go on below us. We are lost in time. I'm an what? adult. No, what album is that on? How it feels. All I know is that you love me. In what my album? Dreams. What album is that it on? Was I, extra, was... It was an extra song on R.S. Speedwagon and the hits in my dreams. No, it was also oh. no, no, no. It was on on Life as We Know It. Life as okay. We Know It. The last okay, album I'll with Gary. To it. The last album with Gary Richrap. I'll listen to it. That's a great fucking song. It's like it makes me cry every time I hear it. Kevin Cronin you know can write shit. He's a great lyricist. And the thing is, they should be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame along with Sticks. And we need to remove review whoa, 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 more whoa, whoa, Sticks whoa, 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 albums, man. We need to do fucking. You know what? Even we though need, I don't, we need, we need even to though do, I don't like, we need to do Stone, Crystal Ball. I'm gonna oh, Crystal Ball, but I mean, even though I don't like Cornerstone, I would do Cornerstone I, too. I do Cornerstone. Just because I'm angry at someone who likes it. I hope it's not me. <laughs> no. <laughs> I or love... not only you. You know, we did a Tommy Shaw yeah. it, yeah? uh, episode. Mm-hmm. Uh, we played a lot of songs. Tommy you Shaw. know what? I like I like Tommy Shaw. You know the song um, something school, like Foolish School or well, whatever. He, the... On his fucking album, you know, his solo album, right? Yeah, We did well, we did his album. We we picked that song. Tommy Shaw, it's on like a uh, let me get it real quick. It's, have... it's not the yeah. one that we did. But... I, I know we did songs by Tommy Shaw with sticks, solo, whatever. Like but, Foolish uh... School or whatever school no, it was. No, no, it's not that, dude. Let me get it. I have it on my phone. All I, I know is Tommy that... Shaw. Okay, here we you go. Know. Girls with guns. Oh, Lonely is school. That the, the Lonely album? school. Lonely school. Lonely school. What album is that? That's off Girls with Guns. Then did we do that album? No, we didn't do the album. We just did songs wow. that people should hear about but, Tommy Shaw. But but I do that album because we I should like... do that album. You we know should what? bring Jerry I, Soup agree. out here. I'm 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 agreeing with you. You know what? The truth is, I like Jerry Soup. I think he's a good co-host. He's a great co-host, just like you are, man. And I he's, can't he's, wait. He's cool. Why haven't you made your GoFundMe for Rock and Pod yet? Let's get you got four months, man. Gotta get the money there. What? It's only because it's in March, man. You need to buy your tickets, man. All right, I'll. I'll do that, but I mean that the whole point is that you know um, what everybody tells me, Lee at the last rocket pod was awesome. I get Lee, 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 Lee. Everybody loves you, Lee. You need to make an appearance. You know, I'll leave you alone. You could go out and do what you ever you want. You know what? I won't follow you like a lost puppy. You know what? Um, I'd be cool with it. The only thing is that um it's not at the original hotel so that they have a hotel like, deal right now at the at the freaking uh whatever is it, it like really in? close to the place yeah i think it is chris and zach just posted it up on the rocket pod that they have deals you have to mention that you're going to rocket pod you know what um i'll send you the link i'll tag you in it because because of the the truth is that I rarely go out. I don't anywhere. go out either, I, dude. I, 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 I want to meet you. I want to meet Jerry. I, I want to meet I, Charles. I want to meet Chris. Even I though meet I Buck, said, Ian. even though I said otherwise, 
The truth is I do want to meet you. I need to meet Eric RSP Jordan. I've already met Eddie Conestrachi. I've already met Vince Kavanaugh. I already met I Chris would and Zach. Pick, I you need know to meet, what? I need to meet if the I fucking Dr. The Fuck. Choice, Dr. Fuck. If and I had Terry the choice of meeting of if I had the choice of meeting the rest of the people on Rock and Pod or only going to LA to meet Edwin and Vincent. I actually would pick Edwin and Vincent. I've already been with them to two concerts, so I'm I'm talking about me. Oh, dude! I they, would they, prefer... they they are amazing people. Vincent and Edwin. You and know I, what? I, and I know Eric Carnes B. Jordan is an amazing person. I know Doctor Fuck. I know Ian is amazing. I know you're an amazing person. I know Charles. I need to meet Jerry. I'm going there to beat my brothers. I'm not going there to fucking be a to promote our podcast. You know, I will have square cards for free form of Mark course, and Jerry and Of Chuck. course, whatever you want to do. But I want to, you know, I want to be with you guys. I want to drink. I want to meet Bushy. I want to meet Bushy. Nate Atchison. I'm not Metal going Mike to mention, Tyler. I'm not going to mention names. I but will. I'm going to say no, no. Brian I'm Davis. I'm talking about Brian right Davis now, might go too. No, no, I'm I'm just saying right now, the reason why I'm going is mostly to meet again certain particular women who I like. That's all I want to say. Courtney Doyd? Oh, I can't say her name. Court, the comedian? Christian Schimbeck? Um, Christian Schimbeck's pretty cool, too. Um, no one that you're talking about. But, uh, Dana, but, but Dana's pretty cool too. She's also very cool. You met her last time, so you're yes. Cool. I yes. haven't. Yeah, she's a cool. All, dude. all I'm trying to say is that um, she's not a dude. She's a lady. I mean, she's a cool girl. All I'm, all I'm trying to say is that, um, other people who you don't know who I'm going to keep quiet about because I don't want you to screw things up. That's you all know, I want. All I want to meet is you, Jerry, Charles, Doc, sorry, Dr. Fuck, Raphael, they put you first, Ian, I met Chris, but I want to meet Aaron. I want to meet the fucking Aaron Camaro. You know he ain't watching this video. I know Chris is. So, Chris, you could tell Aaron to watch I this video. Met, I'm looking at Aaron's. Um, Aaron um, rules. I love Aaron. I want to meet. I Amy. met Aaron. I met um Chris. I met I got Chris. Selfies with. I got a selfie yeah, with Chris. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's that's fucking cool. Yeah. I got a selfie. You know why he asked Aaron. him for a selfie? You want to know why I asked him for a selfie? Because of said, me. Because of you. <laughs> I needed that. But you know what? You. I'm I'm glad you did. You know what? If you didn't ask for yourself, I would have wondered why not. I had to. I said I got to prove to Lee I hung out with you. <laughs> you know what? I would have believed you, but the thing is, I'm glad you did for yourself. I love Chris, man. Uh, great guy. Eric you know Carrell's what? Great guy. We need to get them back here on the podcast. I uh, I know he's you know what? busy I'm, I'm right now, so to... I don't bug him. I'm going to ask Chris again for me. Chris said I texted him. Yes, for you. I know he that. He said he'd be honored to be on your podcast. And 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 he said that to me too. All I'm trying to say is that I um. You're disappearing, dude. <laughs> I'm. I'm. Um. I'm. I'm at the You know Lee, I think you know what up. I mean. I think you're fucked up and you need to say goodbye. Okay, I'm fucked up. Goodbye. <laughs>